content with your life shouldn't be confused with being happy to let everything around you just continue as it is. And we can all find satisfaction in enabling others to develop and grow. Economic transformation, youth development and intercultural cohesion were some of the themes celebrated in Durban. And here we have some of the highlights. India and Africa have a lot in common, including a love of markets. It's all about getting together to see interesting things, do a little business, meet people and have fun. The Essence Festival held in Durban offered all of these attractions, but the underlying purpose was the development of the city, our country and the African continent. Amongst other things, SABC3 showcased South Africa's strong ties with India. The stand offered visitors an opportunity to do some virtual travelling with selfies to prove it. While the secrets of draping various styles of the sari were revealed in detail. And instant mendi was ready to be applied. The Essence Festival is about encouragement, empowerment and really having a good time. We call it a party with a purpose. It is a weekend festival, and all of it is really to empower women. Fragrances, fashion accessories, and decor were there to please the eye. But the event was also intended to inspire, with a number of high-profile speakers addressing issues that got visitors thinking. Essence Festival, it's about a forum where we empower one another. The message is simple to everyone. You deserve more than what you are going through right now. We also concentrate on assistance that could be made available to them. Education is the key to empowerment, and bookstores offered something for readers of all ages and interests. The event also provided a venue where local artists could exhibit their work to an international market. The Essence Festival is a fantastic exposure for artists from South Africa. You are given this platform to play on a global stage. It's just an incredible opportunity for artists who wouldn't normally have the opportunity to show their work to such a large audience. The pop-up gallery presented a cross-section of the rich diversity of style, vision and technique to be seen in contemporary South African arts. On stage, dancers gave a shot of Bollywood energy to the audience, where we met up with a former Mrs. India South Africa, Tracy Maharaj. I've enjoyed the diversity of the South African culture, especially being traditionally Indian woman. It brings out the best of my culture, as well as watching our amazing youth of today performing on stage. Of course, if you look good, you feel great. And in more tangible terms, fashion also has an economic empowerment function by creating jobs and generating sales. Essence is about uh, celebrating what we South Africans and Africa have. I really like how the old designers try to infuse that African feel in all the collections that are presented today. Designers from across the continent presented their personal interpretations of ethnic and fusion styles. <laughs> Spiritual inspiration can also be empowering and the Sunday program featured a mass gospel gathering. The Essence Festival has taken the idea of the African market and given it a 21st century urban twist. And it's a concept that dovetails perfectly with an Indian Mela. It's all part of our shared experience and it can fire Africa with inspiration.